I take my equipment all the time. Uh, I've never had any problems getting it through the, the airport, the different airports. Uh, some want you to take it completely out of the case. Some just want you to open the case. Uh, but they all know what it is. It's not that big of a deal to pack it up and take it with you. And 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 bring it back home again. And then the other thing is, is it's one of those items that the airlines, you're, you know, you're allowed to carry it on board the plane. Um, and it doesn't count as luggage. So it's just a, an item that you, you just carry with you. We take it with us when we go to camp, pack it up, bring it, you know, pack it up, bring it home. Whenever, wherever we go, that uh, CPAP comes with us no matter what. It has packed, it goes on the plane, it doesn't go in storage. Yeah, that's our carry-on. Yeah, that's our carry-on. Yeah, we're on the plane, that's our carry-on is the CPAP. If they lose the luggage, that's one thing. I don't want the, the CPAP that's to get right. lost. We were over in Europe, and it was the first thing that went into my carry-on bag. And my wife said, don't you want to pack? I said, no, no, I don't want anything to happen to it. <laughs> so it is my friend. It goes wherever I go. I took my CPAP equipment to Burning Man. I got a equipment that I could use with a battery and charge this great big battery and took it. And I'm out in the desert in Nevada with 50,000 people <laughs> for Burning Man. It was awesome. It, I, if without that, I couldn't have gone to Burning Man. So it was really nice to be able to get equipment that I could use out there. And it's easy because it's so compact and it just fits in the case so nice and they have all these areas for the different things. So it's very compact. So it is very easy to travel with. And if we're going somewhere, you usually take an extra mask or whatever, just in case yeah. you have a problem, you have your backup. I would tend to, uh, because of the compact size, it's actually easier to fit the machine under a seat than maybe my briefcase or uh, you know, a, a carry-on bag. So I would do a lot of packing my tubing and my mask, things that I don't necessarily want people handling either. I always keep those in uh, zippy bags in case you know the uh, TSA personnel want to you know open up and be handling stuff. Uh, I pack those in my luggage, and then I use the pockets on the CPAP carrying case for a book or a magazine or something like that. It's easier to to get to, and it doesn't count against your uh, carry-on.